this is a warden, and this is Greg the chicken, and this right here is not a fair fight. And for comparison, a warden has 500 health, whereas Greg has a measly four. So knowing this, can we make this a fair fight? With fabric, you can affect the code of any mob you want, but I could easily just convert the base values of Greg to be better than the warden here to kill the warden, but that would be, that would be boring. So I set up a few rules for this fight. I can't affect Greg's base stats. I can't set any attributes of the warden. I can't spawn any new mobs to help Greg. And finally, I can't have Greg place any blocks down. Everything else is free game. Can Greg kill the warden? Right now, the main issue is that Greg just gets one shot anytime he goes close for an attack as the wrong Greg. <laughs> Whenever Greg gets close, it gets one shot by the warden. But... Who said Greg had to get close? Machine gun Greg. Let's see how he does. Okay. <laughs> how much does he have? Oh, that's like a 20 increase from Greg. Okay. Greg's doing a bit more now. He's doing a bit more. He's a bit faster. But can he take down the warden? No, I don't know why. 460. That's it. We're going up. We're going up. Is that enough? No, not even close. Okay. It seems like we're having... <laughs> we're having it's like a log logarithmic... Uh, no one's going to understand that, dude. You're fucking nerd. Okay. We, 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 we like cannot go further than this. When it comes to... <laughs> Okay, surely... Okay, I don't think half of those are doing any damage, dude. I don't think half of those are doing anything. Okay, we, we moved up. Yeah, you probably thought 20x the speed would mean 20x the damage, but because of how Minecraft ticks work, only a small percentage of those arrows actually ended up damaging the warden. And only, only a small, small percentage, percentage of, of you are... My... Now, all we have to do is make sure that the warden is dead by the end of the fight. Nowhere does it say that the chicken has to be alive by the end of it. <laughs> We're using some underhanded tactics here for Greg, but it's... Sh Look, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. <laughs> I didn't know it would do like a hundred. But... Okay, we, we just added 40 more damage, all right? We're moving up. We're moving up. This might just blow up my computer, but anything for Greg. Oh, we have to give we have to give our boy a chance, right? Come on. Okay, it's doing the initial Odin strat. This might destroy my... Yeah, Power 100 just crashes my game, so please subscribe so I can buy a new computer. Like, listen to this. It's on life support. My grandmother is healthier than this and she's dead. Okay, so because the game crashes, we're just going to put it at Power 10. I think that should be enough. And I don't, I don't think it'll kill the warden. I don't think it will. Oh! What the hell? Oh, okay. The nuke have this health though. We are getting close. We are getting close. But still, this just isn't enough damage. But we did learn earlier that just adding more entities just isn't gonna help. So we're not gonna do that, right? Like, surely we're not, like, surely, surely we don't just add more en- I'm gonna be real, guys. I don't know if this will work. I don't trust my code one bit. But, you know, if it breaks, it breaks. All right, Greg. Let's see. Let's see what you got. Yes! Surely this is enough. Surely this is enough to kill you. Please. What? Did that even make a dent, dude? Oh, my God. What? 
Okay, we knew this was gonna happen, but how did I do less damage than before? So, the issue is that the arrows take priority over the lightning on what damages the warden first. So, what if I just shoot lightning? Is that a thing I can do? Look, this is, this is just not gonna work. I didn't- I forgot that it could just kill itself. Okay, maybe the focus shouldn't be damage. It should be time. We know Greg can already do a lot of damage. So, what if we buy him more time so he can kill the warden? And we've used something before that that should just do the trick. Okay, I'm- This is probably gonna immediately kill him. But I think this is genuinely the only option I can think of right now. Look, if, if this doesn't do it, I genuinely, genuinely do not know what will. Okay, so the same nuke it it, it, it it does when it dies, I'm gonna make it so that occurs when it hits him. Come on, Greg. Why did he bomb himself? Wait, what happened there, Greg? <laughs> what? Why is it bombing itself? I'm gonna need- we're gonna need to do some testing here, because I don't think he dies. Okay. Come on, Greg. Surely you see him, dude. <laughs> no, dude! I need you- I need you to look at him! Okay. What? Why does he die there? Oh, okay, wait, wait, wait. I- Okay, I'm gonna check if the the range of the previous one actually kills him. And that was right, that was the case. I would show you the clip of me figuring it out, but I'm recording the code editor! What are you doing?! I was just so done with this challenge at this point, but the sunk cost fallacy was too strong for me to give up this far. Sure, adding lightning to increase the damage didn't work, and adding explosions to increase the time didn't work, so back to square one, right? Wrong! Let's zoom out for a second. Sure, shooting lightning was the worst idea I've ever had, but we can shoot other things too, right? Maybe something that can do a lot of damage and buy Greg a lot of time. Come on now, I'm gonna wait. I'm waiting till you guys get it. If you guys get TNT, you're stupid. You should be very ashamed and you should go kill your- It's River Skulls, baby! Look, dude, if, if if this doesn't work, I generally don't know what will. Okay. They're slow as shit, though. I think I can change that later. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Look, look, look. We can we can still do something. We can still do something. Okay. This one should be faster. Okay, not that fast. But as long as we can keep enough of a distance between the chicken. Okay. Okay, we need to definitely make it a little faster. Okay, okay, okay. We're, we're getting somewhere now, though. We're getting somewhere. We're getting somewhere. Bah! Okay. It should work. The code works. The code makes sense. I read the code. It makes sense. The code makes sense. Bah! Should work. Okay. Okay, we're, we're almost there though, we're almost there, we're almost there. The issue is that when I spawn entities too fast, they collide with each other and kill the chicken immediately. So I had to find a sweet spot for the speed. Okay. Faster than before, this is good, this is pretty decent. It's getting, there's like some crazy combo moves going right now. Hello? Fuck! No! Okay, okay, we're close, we're so close, we're so close. Yeah, this is enough of a speed to keep him, like, at bay. Fuck! 221, 221. But the entities are also getting bounced off the warden straight to Greg, which kills him. So I had to reduce the rate of the skulls being shot. I also added back the lightning. Like, I have no- Like, what are you- What are you even doing, bro? It does not- This should be the one. It's slow enough that it doesn't get shot back. What? Oh, I think it shoots itself. Okay, I just need to make sure it doesn't do that. That should work, that should work, that should work. Well, I'm a genius. You just spawn the fuck stupid thing above the chip. Okay. Okay. After fixing every issue, one by one, 
line by line, it finally came down to this one fight. Greg has lost to the Warden every single time before this. But not this time. Okay, 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 we're getting close, we're getting close, we're getting close, we're getting close. Yes! Ooh. That should... Okay, you're getting nuked anyway. Oh, 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 oh! Oh my god! Finally! Finally! This dude. I'm tired of your shit. I'm tired of your shit. <laughs> dude! Stop! Oh my game. My game crashed again. Yep. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> what? Are you joking? You're joking. <laughs> oh fuck, dude! That is actually so funny.